This is the end of Horden Road where it meets Little Switzerland Drive. Straight over in front of us we can see part of the Jemison Valley. At this road junction, turning left, will take you up to Lincoln's Rock. It's a, a few minutes walk, but we're going right. I have no idea what they're doing over there, but that gate is what we're looking for. Keep to the left at this junction. After about 20 minutes walking, maybe a little less, you come to this spot where it would appear that road materials have been dumped. Certainly this track could use some repair work. Straight ahead takes you to the end of Chester Road and this is our route down to Rocket Point. The cliff top track branches off here that takes us, would take you back roughly to where the car was parked, back at the beginning of Little Switzerland track. From here on you can hear the waterfall, Wentworth Falls, and possibly the cascades above there. The erosion along this track is really bad. You can get to Wentworth Falls by taking the track through the archway. It joins up with the one we saw just a little while ago. Here is Rocket Point Lookout. The waterfall you can hear is Wentworth Falls. It's on the right. We'll start at the left and get a good look. A 
below us here is Jamison Valley and at the halfway point on the cliff you can see the National Pass track which is currently closed there are various other tracks up there in the bush which are hard to make out A few weeks ago, after the heaviest rain, you would not have been able to get through this track from the opposite side where you see these people. But the levels dropped back quite a bit. In the worst of the weather, the track that we've followed in from Horden Road is the, really the only way in. It took about 40 minutes to reach this point from, from where I left the car in Horden Road. So presumably it will take something similar to go back as this is the only way. At this point there's another track branching off which, which will join up with the cliff edge track a few hundred metres along but with better views. Our route continues up. Here is the junction we passed on the way down. Left down to Wentworth Falls. Right the way we go up to Tablelands Road. This brings us back to the little Switzerland track and the road left to Chester Road. We keep to the right until we reach the end of Horden Road. Keep straight ahead here at the gate. This is Little Switzerland track. The way we came. I'm guessing that this is going to be a bus parking area. A few minutes walk up the track past those poles brings you to Lincoln's Rock Lookout. The last part of which is a bit rough on the average vehicle. That's Horden Road Junction straight over there.
this walk took about one hour 20 minutes return only one or two steep parts the worst feature is the bad erosion of the track <laughs>